To mirror entities in Mastercam, we first need to activate the command. We can do that by choosing the icon, or from the drop down menu, we can select X form, mirror. You're going to be prompted next to select the entities to mirror. So I'm going to window select this geometry in my right view. You'll notice it goes black and yellow to show me it's selected. I can end my selection here by pressing the Enter key in the keyboard. I now have several options. I can move the geometry, I can copy the geometry, or I can join the geometry. In this case I'm going to copy the geometry. If for some reason I haven't selected all the geometry or have selected too much, I can click the arrow here to add or remove geometry. My options for mirroring are to mirror about the x-axis, and I can select a point along the axis or mirror about the y-axis. I can also mirror polar on an angle. I can mirror about a line or about two points. I want to mirror about this line, so I'm going to use the mirror about a line option. It's going to tell me to select the line. I'll select this entity. I can zoom out a bit here. My new geometry that will be created is this pink color. And like any command, if I want to continue using it, I can apply it or I can say OK if I'm done. I can also choose to use new attributes. So I can give it a new layer and a new line color for the newly created geometry. Okay. With the preview, I can also turn on the option to fit the screen. And the screen fit fits the mirror geometry and the new geometry. So at this point I'm happy. I'm going to accept my selection and clear my colors.